Hello everybody. Don just left to take two of the aluminum rims from the Bravada to scrap them. And they still haven't shown up to get the Bravada and it is now Wednesday? Yeah. So, I don't know. Someday. Hi. You're cute and you know you're cute. Hi Tog and Gizzard. I just saw Kylo. Where's Kylo? Oh, there he is. Getting hit in the face with Tug's tail. Kylo's a good boy. Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? Good boy. And he has no guard hairs, so he's ridiculously soft. Like a really, really, really soft bunny. And we thought Smokey was soft. Nope. Yeah, we thought you were soft. Not compared to Kylo. But you and Gizzard have the guard hairs. So you guys aren't really very soft at all. And you'll get less soft as you grow. Kitty facts. Well, Don's back, and the bad news is that they're only paying six bucks a piece for those rims now. So, yay. Whatever. Nope. Well, they don't control the prices on what the stuff goes for. So. And no word yet on if they're, when or if they're going to show up and get the bravada. Yeah. They, no, I don't know when they're going to show up, because they just said you know, the last time I talked to him about it, that it could be between when I talked to him or by the end of the week, so. Yeah, well, we need money now, not next year. I know, that's why I got two of them damn tires busted down, but I was hoping for at, at the very least 10 bucks a piece, but. Nope, so you took two in and you got 12 bucks. Woohoo. Yeah. I don't know if it's worth breaking two damn uh, veins in my hands over or not damn 12 bucks, but... Yeah. We don't have any use for the rims, but I want to keep them tired because they're really aggressive tires, so... Yeah. Because we can use them on the yellow and green truck. <clears throat> yeah, the county was just on our road. I don't know what in the hell they're plowing, but... Yeah, snow plow. <clears throat> That's pretty disappointing when you're expecting $60 all total and you get $24 all total instead. Yeah. Shitty. Yeah, because they usually, for, for a lot of years, the rims for the 15 inch usually lingered anywhere between 10 to 15 bucks. Nope, but not anymore. They're down real low right now. The price of everything down, Paul said. He said that a lot of, a lot of people complaining about it. Yeah. But, like I said, he doesn't control prices. He just has to charge what he's told, you know, what the prices are. We're going to go to Family Dollar and get some spaghetti sauce for dinner. And I also wanted to come outside and get some fresh air because I have allergies again. And maybe that'll help. Fresh air. I don't know. No medicine ever works. Thank you. You're welcome. There, we found some sauce. What are you looking for? I think about if we get some uh, Parmesan cheese or not. Either that or do you want shredded cheese? Don't matter. Hi, Tog. Hi, Tog. Yes, we're home. Are you crazy? Good boy. Go in the house. We nope, go in the house. I'll open the door for you. <laughs> go in the house. So this is one of those rims he's gonna sell. Too bad they're not worth hardly anything at all. So uh, this came yesterday, and it came from our friend Sarah. She's also a subscriber, and her kids it says no trespassing. We're tired of hiding the bodies, which is really funny, and it's a, a sign for in the shed. 
we'll put it out there when the weather gets better because you can't hang out in the shed right now anyway it's freezing but thank you very much Sarah so Don is making spaghetti for us with venison hamburger and the noodles and sauce and then there will be cheese I think I'm just gonna make this a two-day one because I'm just getting sicker and sicker <clears throat> and going outside and getting fresh air did nothing so I wish they made algae medicine that worked for me but in the meantime before we go I know he's in the shadows but he's kicking the shit out of that toy but now he quit cuz I'm looking at him you're crazy hello again it's day two now and we still have nothing going on it's snowing out there so big deal on that and Don went back to town to sell the third rim for a few cents, basically. And it's Thursday now and they haven't bothered to show up to get their bravada, so I don't think they ever will. Uh, I mean, why should they care? It's money out of their pockets, not into it. So, I guess that thing gets to sit in the yard forever. And Don won't be in the videos for like two weeks. Because I am avoiding him because yes TMI warning I have PMS and I am not a perfect angel when I have PMS and there's no way I can control it and to have him yell at me PMS is not an excuse to be a bitch is not something I'm gonna put up with so I will be staying away from him so he can have his peaceful life because he can't understand what PMS is like for women Men cannot understand. Their hormones stay the same all the time. So they have no idea what it's like to all of a sudden have everything change and you have no way of stopping it or controlling it or changing it. So it'll just be me and the animals for like two weeks because I'm not putting up with that kind of thing. His uh, lack of sympathy, lack of understanding and complete assholishness. So, more than likely after he sells that rim, he'll go to his brother's because whenever we have a fight, he doesn't want to be around me. And that's okay anyway because, like I said, I won't be around him for two weeks. I'll be staying here in this room and I'll sleep in here too. I'll just use the bathroom. Because since I can't just... There! I stopped! Yay! I'm happy! Since I can't do that, I have to stay away from him. Sorry for the rant, but that is real life and that's how it is. I only have two chapters left in this, and that will finally be finished, and then the next one is this. I'm catching up on all the super editions that I'm behind on before I start the next series, which is Dawn of the Clans, and then after that it is A Vision of, a vision of Shadows, and then after that it is the new series, where only two of them are out so far, and I only own one so far. But I need to start reading these books faster, more often. Because this took me probably a couple months and that's ridiculous. So, I need to get my ass in gear. I'm just in here with the TV on and this is the Roku screensaver. I picked that one because I thought it was pretty cool. And here's White Storm and it's just my setup. I'll be sleeping here tonight and for the next like two weeks. This is a pull-out bed, but those things suck. You feel like you're laying on, a, on metal bars. So the couch itself will be more comfortable because I'm not putting up with any more crap. Any more men who don't understand what happens to women. It's not something I choose. It's not something I can control. It's not something I can stop. It's not something I can change. That, that's just how it is. And he was like, oh, I've had women tell me before that their PMS doesn't affect them. Well, that's them. That's not me. Every person is different. So, I don't know. It's just ridiculous. And avoiding him is the only way to keep him happy. Right, White Storm? Aw. Hey, Smokey. At least you guys don't judge. That's a good thing about animals. Animals don't judge. Right? But anyway, Don said he was going to the dump. Like, 
half hour, 45 minutes ago, and that's within walking distance of here. So he must be at his brother Dave's or his sister Becky's to avoid me, and that's fine, whatever. That's how things go when people don't understand that men and women are different and there's nothing they can do about it. But it did stop snowing. And uh, the, the sun was out, now it's going down. But I got a snowstorm warning on my weather app on my phone, so we'll see what happens with that. And Don did poke his head in here and said that Crowed Salvage was coming either tonight or tomorrow night. Well, it's almost five, so I don't think it's going to be tonight. And I don't want them to come when he's not here anyway because he's the one doing the business. What am I supposed to do here by myself? So it's kind of rude and inconsiderate of him to go away when somebody told, told him they might be here. So, oh well. And here's big fat fluff Kylo enjoying the wood stove heat. Even though earlier it was 90 degrees in here and I had the windows open and the fans in the windows because it was just horrible in here. I guess kitties would rather roast. Right? You big fluff. Big soft fluff. And this is where Tug is, hogging the whole couch, since I won't be sitting on it for a long time. It's all yours! You should be happy! And one more kitty. Smokey. Gizzard is in the bathroom. I just saw him in there. As always. But Smokey's hiding under the chair. So I guess I'll go ahead and end this video, because it's nothing but boringness when it's just me. And I'm, I can't go anywhere or anything. Car's not even here if I wanted to. So I'm going to go ahead and say goodnight, and I hope you enjoyed the video, and that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. And I'll see you next time.